I'm in Turkey still. I'm in Olympus, which uh, although it has, a, it has a Greek name, and uh, I suppose when I first heard Olympus, I thought it, it was Greek or it was in Greece, but it's in Turkey. But it's a settlement that goes way back to the uh, Hellenistic period and then the Roman period, the uh, Byzantine. So it's, it's been quite an important settlement. Now there's loads and loads of ruins around here, uh, going up, going going back as I said to, to the Hellenistic period, and then the Roman period, and then the Byzantine. Uh, so now it's um, well, it's a tourist resort now. So lots of tourists come here. Uh, it seems to be mainly Turkish at the moment. It's only noon now. It's just uh, twelve o'clock, and it's roasting here. And uh, so we're on the coast of the Mediterranean, and there's a big, huge beach here. It's about uh, four or five k long. And it's really nice. It's, it's stones. It's different types of stones, different grades of stones. But there's some one one part is uh, is it's almost sand, and then there's a fibrous stone, and then a medium and all different types of stones but it's not uh, very rocky at all and it seems that the water it, it gets deep uh, very very fast because I can see people who are just out a couple of metres and already up to their uh, chest area up to their neck almost so it seems to uh, it, it slopes quite fast it looks lovely here the temperature now and it's only noon as I say the temperature is about 25 degrees there's a there's a slight wind blowing so it's like fairly pleasant but once you get into the shade the temperature drops quite a lot and yesterday we were on our, on our way here we were going through the Taurus mountain range <clears throat> and there was ice and snow there there was about a foot of snow or a half a meter in I knew money <laughs> and it was freezing <clears throat> but uh, it, it was a pleasant time to the cold because it was uh, there was lovely sun shining and beautiful smell of the cedar trees and the pine trees and the uh, and uh, the occasional clip of wood smoke, and it was a delightful journey. Actually, it was one of my nicest journeys yet. Although, as I said, it was cold, <coughs> but uh, I loaded no clothes on, so I was perfectly warm, <coughs> and it was pretty bracing. But that's part of the ex experience, really. You feel that you're more in contact with nature. So this is a, a view of Olympus, ancient Olympus, and on the. Uh, road here from the uh, place we're staying. We're staying in the uh, wooden huts, uh, about a kilometre and a half walk from here. And it's it's okay. It's quite nice. It's not terribly fancy, but it's quite basic. But it's really uh, different to what I'm used to being in. And it's these wooden huts are little little uh, sort of, uh, shallows, uh, chalets, and they're all uh, surrounded by uh, uh, woods. So it's, uh, it's, it's, it's actually grand. <clears throat> so the, the walk along from the uh, accommodation to here, it, it was through a, a museum area of all the old ruins of the Ipidical palaces of the, the Roman forts, the uh, ethnistic uh, graves of the uh, and where they buried their uh, dead, dead, these amazing uh, tombs, uh, very, very elaborate carved tombs. So it's, it's uh, quite a nice area. So it's a combination of uh, pleasure of the beach, of course, and uh, and, and the stuff that titillates the mind and the imagination as well as the senses. Oh, that suits me. Although I'm not mad about beaches, uh, I don't like being uh, stuck in one place and having to uh, just roast. So uh, I'm not going to spend long on the beach, I'm just going to walk around and then head uh, back to the ruins. And there's lots of walks around here, there's loads of uh, walks along the Elysian Way. So that'll be my uh, journey for today and this evening we're going out to see a natural uh, flame. It's apparently it's this side of the mountain and there's all uh, gases leaking from it. So there's a large area where it's all a flame, it's like it's a, this side of the mountain is a flame. And of course, there are loads of myths attached to that, and it's called the e e eternal flame. <laughs> uh, so that, that's me today. More later on.